The tiny homes project for the homeless is getting another chance in San Jose following backlash from some community members. KPX 5's Maria Medina live outside City Hall with what council members have just decided. Maria? Yeah, Veronica, just a short while ago, city council members voted to move forward with a tiny home project, 40 homes, and at least three different sites. Question now is, where will they go? Everybody needs the help. Everybody out here needs a little bit of help. Everyone. For the last couple of years, Kimberly Gann has lived in a trailer with her husband on the San Jose Street near Mineta International Airport. It's bad. It's bad. You have a lot of people sleeping in tents. Her trailer is feet from one of more than 120 sites being considered by city leaders to build a tiny home community for the homeless. It's going to help some, not a whole bunch, but it will help some of them. I don't think there's any silver bullet or any one solution, but we're excited about the opportunity to look at whatever options we have to get people off the streets. City leaders came up with a list of 99 city owned properties as potential sites, but some residents rallied against welcoming the homeless communities in their neighborhoods. So the city housing department added nearly two dozen other properties to the list farther from schools and neighborhoods and are now focused on narrowing down the best sites. We're going to be looking at a proposed scoring matrix to help select and score sites. So we're looking at environmental factors. We're looking at proximity to uh, neighborhoods. My strong opposition to the tiny homes proposed. While city leaders say they'll hear out concerned community members who don't want the tiny homes near them at all. It will draw as a magnet for more homeless to come into our area. Kimberly, who is one of more than 4,000 homeless in San Jose, says something needs to be done. There's a lot of kids out here. You wouldn't, you wouldn't think so, but there are. There's a lot of kids out here. And what do you see there? Are they so now they try to figure out where these tiny homes will go. They have to be built by 2022. Live in San Jose, Maria Medina, KPIX 5.